Hi and welcome students. In this Microsoft Word 2016 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change font size of selected text. Let's get started. So you'll see that I have a Microsoft Word document here and it already has some text on it. If you ever want to check the size of your current text in your document, you just have to go to the Home tab, Font Group, and then you'll see right up here is the Font Size button. The font size button uh, can be accessed right here and you can use this to change the size of your text. You'll see that my blinking cursor is right here letting me know that if I were to type right now it would be size 26. Let's say I were to reduce this to size 8 and I click on it and then I begin to type. You'll see here that the text is very small. That's because this is now 8. Now keep in mind that uh, if you select text it will change the text of your selection. So if I were to select community, you'll see that this now shows 26 right up here. And if I hit this drop down arrow, you'll see all of my text options and it'll actually show me the size being changed as I increase and decrease the sizes. You'll see 72 is the largest and 8 is the smallest. You'll also notice that some of the numbers don't exist on here. You'll see 20 jumps to 22. There's no 21. Well, if you want a custom size, what you have to do is go right up here, click on the current size, which in this case is 26, and then type in the size that you want. I'll type in 21 right here and press enter, and you'll see that now it's size 21, just in between 20 and 22. So that's how you create a custom size. Keep in mind that if I were to select the entire title right up here, and then I go up to my font size, it's now blank. That's because one or more size or one or more words has a different size from the rest. So right here, since community is size 21 and everything else is size 26, there's nothing listed up here since it doesn't all have a uniform size. But if I were to click this drop down arrow and then I were to choose size 20 for instance, you'll now see that it changes to say 20 up here and now all of the sizes are the same. There's also a shortcut to quickly increase and decrease font sizes. You go to the Home tab, Font Group, and then just to the right of it, there's a button for Increase Font Size. If you click that, it'll increase. Notice that these are the same increase amounts that are listed on this drop-down list. For instance, it'll go 26, 28, 36, 48, and you can see here, Increase Font Size, 26, 28, 36, 48. As I decrease the size, which is the button just to the right of that, decrease font size, you'll see that again it decreases in those same increments. There we go. Finally, you could go to the Home tab, Font Group, and you can click the bottom right button, the Font Dialog box, to open this up to further change your font size right over here. This does generally the same thing, but gives you more font options and effects right in this area. I'm going to click Cancel here. And finally, I'm going to show you how to change the font for your entire document. If I click within my document and do Control A on my keyboard, that'll select all of my text. Notice that once again, since we go to the Home tab font group, we see blank right here. That means that there's multiple sizes within this selection. If I click this drop down list and say I make everything size 14, now the entire document will be size 14. That includes my title, my subtitle, my headings, and all of the body text. And that's how you change the entire uh, selection of your uh, document at once. So hopefully this video has been helpful for you. If it has, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. And if you have any questions, please put it in the comment section below and I'll do my best to respond to you. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video and have a great rest of your day.